No man is above the law. It behooves you to remember that. Hello and welcome back to Civilization VI. And here we have the... Again, we're doing true start locations on... Uh, you know, it, not yet another Earth map pack. But this time, I decided to do something a little more interesting. And what I'm going to be doing, I found... A zombie mod so to speak it's not really zombies I guess it's like uh, every time you eliminate a barbarian camp like 10 more barbarians spawn out of it and I believe point uh, wait can I skip that cuz I um, Cities cannot be put under siege. Yeah, enemy spies, city gains, extra five. Okay, let's just get through all this. Yeah, this this shit's gonna take a minute to get through. Land acquisition. And view your promotions. Wait, why can't I? I can't assign them to anything, so... I don't remember... I would imagine if I lose an enemy... Or lose an enemy... Lose one of my units to... A barbarian... Then it'll probably turn it into a barbarian as well. I would imagine that's how it works. I, just, I don't recall at the moment, though. Um, let's see. Trade routes. Yeah, I can't do anything with him. At least not until I get a second city up. And production. Let's do a harbor. I, oh, damn it. Okay, I'll do that there. Oh, uh, okay. Let's go here. Oh, yeah, and I set the uh, speed of the game to quick as well. Let's see. Industrialization. It's going to take 99 turns. God damn. Colonialism. Civil engineering. Let's just go civil engineering. New government. Let's go with... Let's go with the Merchant Republic. Um, 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 there should be something. <clears throat> Unit maintenance, there we go. And I'm in the industrial era. The next one is the modern era. Let's see, newly trained units. Your builders get two extra builds. Oh wait, actually. Oh, excuse me. Uh, do I still get that bonus for fighting barbarians? If I have that, yeah, might as well have it. Renaissance era, medieval and renaissance era, medieval... Renaissance and industrial era heavy and light cavalry units. I'll do that. And da 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 da. Come on. Plus two influence points. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Confirm policies. Yes. Next turn. Will any barbarians show up? Okay, let's settle that city. And now I can send that trader over to Philadelphia. Can 
campus right there. Was that pike and shot? Okay, and can I where 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 where? There you are. Automate exploration. Do I really want to have military units exploring? And why not? Ooh, village. Sugar? Yeah. I'm, oh, yeah, two sugar. I'm definitely going to make a city down here. Probably put it right there. Then I can get tobacco and the two sugar. Hey, some amber. Q, Q, Q. Oh, yes, the niter. Sweet. And next turn. No sign of the zombies yet. Okay, I got that harbor done. Hmm. A shipyard really would not be a bad idea. But neither would walls. I'll keep my city safe. A recommended settlement location. Interesting. Are there any more, not any more immediate luxury resources around the area? Kind of surprised I haven't found any barbarians yet. And there goes his last build. And milk. Um, oh wait, yeah. He's exploring. He's not a builder. Huh. <laughs> More niter out west. Cool. Okay, there's the edge of Florida. Yeah, I'd like to figure out if the Cree and the Aztecs are here. I mean, it's going to be kind of boring if I'm the only person on this continent, honestly. Even if I'm fighting the barbarians. Damn it. Most annoying thing is when you move another tile and you don't uncover anything. <laughs> Oh, hey, Palinky. I might be able to send trade routes there then. Still no sign of any barbarians. Wow. Oh, wait a minute. Ooh, okay, silver. Okay, so that boosted my production. I could get another settler real easy, actually. Crossbowman or another settler. 
Actually, let's do a commercial hub. Are there any plus threes? I see a lot of plus twos. Okay, I'll do that there. Pearls. Mother of Pearl. Maybe I could get a city right there. Let's see. One, two, one, two, three. Sweet. Okay, if I have a city right there, that'll be perfect. Oh, shit. And the barbarians starting to spawn in. Okay, build a farm. Ten turns. Oof. Take ten turns for another crossbowman. Sixteen for a pike and shot. Oh, God. If they do weaken us, I think I can just retreat into the water, but... I hope they don't... I just hope they don't kill us in, like, one shot. Palenka, come help me. Build a camp. And next turn. Oh, never mind. You. Now next turn. Ooh, they moved back. Smart. Okay, that's going to eliminate them. Now what's going to happen? Is it going to spawn more units now because I eliminated it? Yep. Spawn four units. Holy shit. Retreat. Zombie, zombie, spitter, zombie, zombie. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> this got very quickly interesting. Oh man. Um, I feel very compelled to build one of these things. Um, yeah, let's do it on the hill. I want to keep sending this scout out north and west a little bit because I want to see if I can find the Kree. If I can find the Kree, they'll make a good ally. That is if they're in the mood to make friends right now. Okay, run. Okay, my crossbowmen and my other pike and shot are getting back, so that's good. 
Okay, I just had to run across that bay. There's another barbarian. Okay, got an encampment. Let's get some musket men. I definitely want to get a boat to, like, a frigate. I think I need iron for that, though. And I currently have none. Uh-oh. Promote. Heal. Run away. Next turn. Oh god, they're chasing me. Yay, okay, okay. I got a crossbowman here now. He can help in defense. Can you fortify? Ah, the thing is, is I need to also focus on maintaining and progressing in my civilization compared to the other civilizations, but then I need to worry about these hordes of zombies that are going to be popping up. I wonder if the other civilizations over in Europe and Asia are having any, any more luck <laughs> than... Or any better luck than I am, I guess. Harbor. No, I don't need a harbor. Bank, entertainment complex, theater square. Hmm. Let's do an industrial zone. Send more envoys to Palenque. <clears throat> Next turn. Okay, that pike and shot move this way. I'm getting towards the top of the map. I'm probably going to need to start heading more west. If the Kree are actually on here, because I set all the other players to random, and it was me, it was 20 players total, so me and 19 others. And then I think 15 city-states. I definitely want to get down here and settle a city before Palenque gets any tiles on North America, because I do not want that. That trader can go to Palenque. Get me some science and more gold. Hmm. I have two more possible trade routes that I can do. After this musketman, I want to get a settler, especially because the housing is full. Oh, it's not full. I just have nine turns. Correct? Yeah, nine turns until popular. Oh, shit, scout. I have no military here. Oh, fuck. Oh, actually, wait. If I keep him there, he'll s that musketman will spawn there. That's actually better. It's looking like the cream might not be here. Oh, there's an encampment up north. Okay. Uh-oh. Well, 
Will that kill him in one turn? Yes. Okay. All right, go reinforce the northern border. Okay, now go with the settler. Oh, it's only going to take two turns. I like it. Philly, Philly, what do I want in my Philly? I could do another settler. Uh, yeah, I should do another settler, actually. Because I, I just need to focus on trying to expand right now. Mostly. I mean, obviously I need to worry about defense, but... Expanding is also very key to success here. Because the more cities I have, the more things I can do. Okay, fortify there. Next turn. You're going north, and you're going north. One more turn until the settler's done. Damn it. If I can, really, I would like to secure the entire eastern coast. Make sure no one can migrate in the United States. <laughs> okay, let's go along the water. Yeah, I was going to say, there's definitely going to be guys down there, so... I'm going to need to send an expeditionary force. Keep the musket men there, though, because I need the defense up north. Go with another musket man. It's gonna take nine turns. Fuck it, I'll do it. Next turn. F somebody built Potala Palace. Wait, what was that? What? Oh my god, spitters can do ranged attacks? Shit. This is going to be tough. Like, this is not going to be easy at all. <laughs> Yeah, no, I think the Kree aren't in here, unless they're further over here. I don't know. Palenki, you want to come over and help me out here? How much to annex your, your military? The violent economics are urbanization, industrialization, centralization, efficiency, quantity. Blech. Settler, settler, set. Oh shit. Wait, did I lose a unit? Oh no, I didn't. Thought I did for a second. That kind of scared me. They are almost dead though. Hey, choose research. Uh, you know what? Cannons would be really useful. Why the hell not? You use those against those zombie motherfuckers. I am right next to water, so I don't need an aqueduct. I got a settler. Oh, let's build some crossbowmen. Next turn. 
that territory down there is safe at the moment, so I can get him there and then settle a city real quick. I'm going to get him on the eastern side, actually. That way I can get those pearls. Get the pearls and the sugar. Okay, you attack. I'm just going to have them fall back. I was going to say, probably the smarter idea there. Damn, it hit the Pacific. Yeah, it looks like the Kree aren't here. I would I would think they'd be somewhere right around here. Or like right here even. Because I remember I played as the Kree in Civilization V one time for like, well, it was like four episodes before I ended up getting wiped out. Because I horrible... I was horrible and it ended up getting a horrible fucking spawn myself too. But mostly I just sucked. But <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I spawned right up around there, so it looks like they just aren't in this one, I guess. Deliver a ranged attack. Okay, now, just in case he can move a bunch, like a lot faster than I expect, then I'm gonna move that guy on top. Keep him protected. Promotion? Oh boy. Alright, well I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up and share this video. If you have, if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. And if you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please leave them down below in the comments section. Hope you have a great day. Peace out.